Today I'm working on a 2014 Audi Q5 with a TDI engine. It has a mystery coolant leak. EGR cooler was already replaced at the dealer and uh, it has not resolved the coolant leak. Had pressure on the system and there was no leak found. It held pressure overnight. Didn't even lose one PSI sitting overnight. Um, when you when you, and when, and when you look at everything after you have pressure in the system, you, you don't see any coolant leaks anywhere and it's all dry after we cleaned it all off. But when you take it for a spin and you drive it for, you know, extended test drive, you'll see coolant all over the front of the motor. Ends up, what it's going to end up being here is this uh, thermostat housing, oil filter housing. Um, I have it off right now. It's this right here. It's, um, here it is. Pretty easy to replace. It's just a plastic housing that the uh, thermostat goes into and oil cooler and uh it's, it's plastic so it distorts and uh, no longer holds this seal you know nice against the front of the engine and um yeah that would explain kind of why it's leaks more when the thermostat's open and the thing is hot so yeah not too bad of a job to do at all you just this one coolant pipe here kind of plugs in over here into the front of the housing and um, this hose comes off and then the low radiator hose right here comes off and then the rest is just a bunch of T30 Torx bits that hold it on and uh, a couple plugs for these pressure senders. And that's it, pretty easy job to do actually. So if you have a weird coolant leak off the front of your diesel and uh, you notice it more when you drive it and it's just all over your drive belt and difficult to identify, um, it's likely your uh, oil filter housing, thermostat housing. Thanks.